Hey guys, here is what we're going to do with today's molecules lab. So I am sharing a Google Doc with you and I've opened it in the OCS Junior High email and it looks like this. So you would open here, invitation to edit, open in docs, click that, and it comes over here and shows you this. Now, it's ready for you to type your name in Except, if Samantha goes in, she's just edited my copy of it. Which means she could go through all the work and she could do the entire lab with me. And then when Kira comes along to do hers, she could erase and accidentally do the exact same worksheet that Samantha had worked on. And so what your first step is going to be when you open this up is you are going to make your copy. And to do this, you're going to come over here. You're going to go file, make a copy. So before we do that, you have opened the molecules lab from the email, open in docs. It opens and looks like this. You come up to file, make a copy. Now this comes up and you're going to say this is Molecule Lab and then whose is it? Put your name in there. Put your name in there so that it is then open and you're then going to click the share it with the same people box. That means that your lab instantly gets shared with me and I'm able to see your worksheet for me to give you the grade for. And that way I can also help you if you get stuck along the way. So then you would click OK and it's gonna open here if my internet works. Here we go. 1111, make a wish. Here we go. Now you are in your molecules lab and now you can start putting your name in, reading with me, which I'm gonna do in this next video. You can then come in and you can say, I am choosing to use my yellow and just click through and I'm going to show you in the next video as we build our molecules here together. But you can come in and you can answer. You can choose a different color for your font if you want it to pop out. Like what do models show us about molecules? They make molecules 3D so we're able to see and visualize what molecules are really like. Maybe that's my answer and I decide to do it in a different font so that I can tell my work from the worksheet. You may do that. It's up to you. Scroll through. There's nothing to answer on this page. And then here is our final reflection sheet like we always do together in class. And you've got a few questions there. Okay, so that is how you are going to get your Google Docs set up to do this lab with me. All right, so this is step one to our molecules lab. Once you have copied and made the Google Doc your own, then you're ready to move on to step two and the next video with me. All right.